In this video, I'm going to talk about how you can instantly improve at multiplayer games. It's not a skill, it doesn't take practice, and it's not cheating. It's just a basic understanding of how online multiplayer games work. It's most useful in games like CSGO and Rainbow Six Siege. Alright, so to understand how to use this mechanic to your advantage, first you have to understand what ping is. Ping is just the amount of milliseconds it takes for your computer or client to send and receive data from the server. The data is then sent to your opponent's clients. So if I walk forward on 20 ping, the server doesn't know that until 20 milliseconds afterwards. If my enemy is on 30 ping, he will then take 30 milliseconds to receive the information that I walked forward for a total of 50 milliseconds. So let's say I'm behind a wall and I strafe right. My enemy won't see me till 50 milliseconds after I see him. This means I have 50 milliseconds to line up my shots and try to kill my enemy before he can kill me. Keep in mind that if our pings were different, then it might be 40 milliseconds or 100 or just something different. It's just the total of the two people's pings. Keep in mind the average human reaction time is around 250 milliseconds. Most gamers are a bit faster and probably closer to 200, especially at top ranks of games. So basically you could be increasing your enemy's reaction time by 25% going off the 50 millisecond number. This would give you a massive advantage in any gunfight. This concept of being able to see your enemy first while peeking is known as peeker's advantage. Now for Valorant specifically, I've heard a lot of people say peeker's advantage doesn't exist or it's less important. And I believe that's because you can't accurately move while shooting. Peeker's advantage does still definitely exist. It's just diluted by the inability to move while shooting. Now you can still definitely take advantage of it, especially in close range engagements. In most games, however, Peeker's advantage is really overpowered, so try to include it in your playstyle as much as possible. If you like this kind of content, subscribe for more and like this video. Thanks for watching.